John and today we are testing our MP1700 printer which is a roller fed and this is a 17 inch printer this is a like a semi production printer already so it has a roll feeder at the back and yeah, sorry for the mess because you know this is a brand new printer and we are testing it we just finished converting it in here at McLeod laboratory and, and this is our laboratory so see guys this is a mess do you think this is our laboratory here oh my god did you see all those mess here so this is our laboratory so now we're printing to design okay to design here and this is how it shows now so it's about to get out you have to bear with us but uh yeah so it's a different setting. So if you are uh, using a 17 inch printer, the setting is different from the from the L1800, which you are very much familiar. So this printer has, uh, it can, you know, in your L1800, in the white, you can throw like 90 nozzle. This one is 180 nozzle. So this printer has a, uh, it's like a twice the speed of L1800. This is what I can say with this because it has an eight channel. You see the ink there? The ink is nine. Two, you see that? Two, four, six, eight, nine. So it has a nine inks. Look at that. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So it's nine ink. So I put five whites into this, five whites. I'll show you later the configuration. It's five whites and four same YK. So now it goes now to the second, to the second, uh, second image. So so this is the the, the image that we're doing. This is a really good printer. So this is a desktop, desktop, I think I could call it desktop production printer because this one really delivers the production. Uh, for the L1800 that was there, so you see our L1800 too. I'll close it up. It has a roller also. So in McLeod, we highly recommend if you are in the t-shirt printing business, I highly recommend you use the roll but if you are just starting you can start with the with the sheets but this printer can load both sheets and roller all all of our printers that we release now it is loaded with uh with uh it can be loaded with sheets and roller but the roller that's where you save the you save the the film because the film is the biggest cost in printing so here the cost of the film is like right now currently is 270 dollars 270 dollars divided by 328 feet so per linear foot okay per linear foot is less than a dollar i cannot i don't have the calculator to compute it exactly but 270 divided by 328 that's the cost of the film per linear foot so if your design if your design is one is 12 inch long like this this is not even 12 inch this is like a eight and a half or nine inch so think about it the cost of the film now 
maybe the cost of printing including the ink and the the ink and the powder is maybe a dollar because uh, 328 less uh, 270 divided by, divided by 378 is 328 270 270 dollars for the for the for the film okay divide of 328 that's less than a dollar so if you add the ink and the powder that will cost you a dollar maybe less okay depends on how much ink and how much powder what, what kind of powder you're gonna use but most likely the cost of printing here the cost of transfer now is a dollar so if you have this printer it will cost you a dollar now most likely more or less to one to one to one linear foot so per design is about one it's 12 inch if you're using a, a 13 inch printer so yeah that's one so think about it it's cost you a dollar per per design a 12 inch width here so because the the, the height here is 17 inch so think about it a dollar man you get the full color and you got the full design and a dollar per plus labor of course that's that's additional part of you so here you can see here printing complete cut of printer page cut no cut so if you want to do the cut so okay i'll show it to you so that's how it works you know so you put the cut and so the the roller will move see it will move see that it moves so it allows you to cut the the design okay so what we're gonna do now is to cut it but you will sh i will show it to you how it works how good this printer is so i'm cutting it right now okay let's do it i'm not a left-handed but uh because because this is at december 24 now so my assistant is off cutting it okay hold me a little bit guys because I'm about to end oh 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 oh, oh, oh shoot Good. this is the problem you have that oh I messed up the <laughs> the, the, the transfer okay but it's here it is okay we'll put it here on top of the printer so that's it oh i'll wipe these things okay so anyway for the purpose of that so it's cut already right so once it cut i'll put these things away Okay. So now once that the thing is cut, oh, this is a brand new printer. We'll have to wipe the ink, you know. Okay, now let's go. So once it's cut and it's finished already cutting, okay. So all you have to do is press the 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 button finish, and look at that, guys. It will just came back by itself, reverse by itself. Okay. Now I'll show you what happened next. So now, it's the paper still loaded and ready to print for the next time. So this is really an automatic printer. So if you want a hassle-free printing with a dollar or less cost of printing, this is the best printer. So if you have the budget, uh, I think you better go with this because, yeah. So you can print now a bigger one you know if you have a big uh hoodie with uh, a4 size or a5 size and you know you want to print as as big as 17 inch uh yeah this one is really good and we have one big little secret here because uh, you know when we started when we started 
so the problem here it's smearing the the the, the film is gets smeared all the time but now we solve it and this is really good this is so perfect in the way it runs so guys look at this printer this is the best printer that you will have okay so check our website and we will shipping out this printer and yeah we will have two printers in the pipeline that right now for testing we have the mp0805 that is a eight and a half inch uh, dta printer because somebody bought uh, that model eight and a half inch wide so we have to test it now and that printer is really good for tags you know it's small tags and small printing so this is the best one but this but this is a production of desktop production printer i will call it a desktop production printer now if you want a big production printer then you have to get our 24 inch which uh we will show you how it works so sorry for the mess guys sorry for how it looks but this is the real thing it's tested uh, you know in mcleod we have the testing we are not just selling the product we are inventing or innovating the product okay so